Frank. Occupation, office editor. Partner, Isabella. Mr. Frank, I see you have led quite a fulfilling life. Who the hell are you? What is this place? Verily, I say unto thee, thou shalt by no means come out thence till thou hast paid the uttermost farthing. Huh? All valid questions, Mr. Frank, will be answered in due course. Due course? Patience should be not just a virtue. It should be a practice. Now, as I've said, you will receive your answers when the time is right. But I don't understand! Yes, well, you have been brought here for a reason. For reasons I do believe you will be very interested in hearing. Mr. Frank, you need to take a deep breath, relax, and calm down. Right. Now, Mr. Frank, to be so angry, so full of rage, is not to do well, as the rest of humanity has proven. Huh? Man, trusted with the power to destroy, and although many choose this path, there are a small minority who do not. Wouldn't you say so, Mr. Frank? I'm not sure I follow you. I wonder, if one man was faced with the power to destroy for his own personal gain, what would he choose? Well, um, people can be quite selfish most of the time. <laughs> Indeed, Mr. Frank. Self-interest, I do believe the term is. So, Mr. Frank, I wonder which you would choose. I don't know. It does not fit well to avoid questions asked of you. It depends on the situation. Just give me a situation and I'll tell you. World poverty or your poverty? Mine. Your family or you? My family, of course. Look, these are really strange questions. Is there a point to this? Your life or somebody else's? Well, that's different. I mean, it's not fair to play God and say who is allowed to live or not. Now we come to the point. What's that? All the answers you desire. That's... that's... How, how did you get that? Where did you find it? Who are you? This is... this is messed up! I believe this has some kind of significance to you. My girlfriend gave it to me. On our first date. Hang on. Why are there two? One bracelet is the prized trinket from Isabella. And the other? A fake. However, attached to it is a very large, life-changing sum of money. Ten million, to be precise. All you have to do is choose. There must be a catch. You are no fool, it seems. Choose the real locket, and you walk away. Go back to your life with Isabella. Choose the fake, and you get the money. But someone anywhere in the world could die. But bear in mind, this could be me or you. That one. Time is money. Oh. No, no, wait. Choose. Final answer. That one.
Thank you.